Hey over there, Joe Lunchbox. And Joy Nightingale. And today we're coming to you from our home here in the most magical place on earth, Long Island. Mm -hmm. Now we're here to do a taste test review for you. But not just any item. I'm a big fan of wrestling. So when I heard Maxwell Jacob Friedman, Long Island's own MJF, had a company made pickles for him. We had to get all the MJF pickles <laughs> to try all the MJF pickles and tell you what we thought of that though. I love me some AEW. I love me some pickles. I am a fan of MJF. I am a fan of MJF. <laughs> so we got some pickles to try for you. <laughs> Hopefully you like this kind of thing. If you do, you should like this video, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, ring the bell, comment down below if you haven't done it already. I don't know what's wrong with you. Do it already, okay? I'm being a heel like MJF. I love you all, thank you. Shh. All right, but it's time to do this, so step right up. Let's go for this ride. All right, so when you get MJF pickles, we got three different kinds. MJF champion chips, which is honey mustard chips. MJF's better than your dill, AKA classic dill. And MJF's Spicy Devils, which is spicy garlic spears. Hopefully the devil gets his due. Ooh. All right. Where do you want to start, Joy? Where do you want to end? So let's start with honey mustard. It's different than what I've known. It's pickles and mustard. Yeah, but like a honey mustard type. Are you a true New Yorker? And, and you know... Pickles, New Yorker. I go for straight Jewish dill a lot of times. Me too. <laughs> these are uh, made by a company. I want to mention the company that actually made these pickles. <laughs> Kaylin and Kaylin Pickles from Los Angeles, California. Huh? I know. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Sealed for your protection. <laughs> Don't be a fool. Always wrap your pickle. So here we have pickled chips with honey mustard. That is good. That is really good. I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I was nervous. Um, <laughs> a lot of times when I think of pickled chips, I think of more bread and butter pickles, sweeter pickles. We don't want to waste all that honey mustard juice. I know. <laughs> I'm a trained professional here at handling pickles. <laughs> So I was nervous that even though when I heard honey mustard, I thought it was going to be a sweeter mustard, a sweeter pickle. That's why I was more curious about it because I thought it was like more of like the honey mustard, like the Dijon where it's on the sweeter side and not on the more tangier of the mustard side. But this has a really good balance of the yeah. both. It's sweet but savory all in one. Yeah. Which is the way like this it should be. I was debating to whether to start with this or the regular dill one and the mustard sauce really is like a brine it's not like they're like mm -hmm. coated in a mustard and it's just like they're getting infused with it yeah so i like it i was like we'll start off these it's gonna be my least favorite so that's what i was totally thinking about yeah. also like uh, uh, I, I, <laughs> I i have to be honest though i'm it's my fault i apologize mjf wouldn't put his name on a bad pickle. No. Those are good. You're like, Joe, did you buy three jars of pickles just for this video? No. I bought three jars of pickles to eat and also share Just for the jars you. also. <laughs> I don't know if you can see right now, but behind Joy, uh, we have my um, part of my bottle collection. I like stuff. The other part's that way. Yeah. Uh, I try to save a jar from everything I've tried in my life for a bottle, something I drank in my life. Not like every one I ever drink, but just like one of a kind. Or so, if the bottle's like really cool and we still don't like the flavor, we keep the cool bottle. These are like, I'm gonna keep them. Yeah. I'm Lunchbox, I have to have a, my own food <laughs> museum. I think we're going, uh, I think we're going right down the line and we're gonna go to 
MGF's better than your dough. Just regular dough that we know. Well, obviously not. If these are supposed to be better. These pickles are better than yours and you know it. They really want you to unscrew for a while. Well, they want to make sure that it's always protected. Here, Joy, this one's for you, because I know you love a big dill pickle. I was gonna get that one over there, but okay. Mine might be short, but it's a little girthy. Pickle jokes. I know. All right. Cheers. I've never had a dill pickle to taste like this before. I was checking the label because to me it tastes like I'm at a good Jewish deli. I have a good dill pickle and I'm eating my pastrami on rye because something about the pickle has a lingering flavor that reminds me of like the caraway seeds in rye bread. And I was seeing if there's caraway seeds in this. There is mustard seeds but no caraway seeds. That's what I was thinking, because I was like, it had like the good sharp dill taste, and then like chewing, and then it just like comes back. Yeah, but it finished with that like that rye bread flavor, which goes with the pickle. Mm -hmm. Yes, MJF, your pickle is better than theirs, and they know it. I feel like this should be sold in stores now. It's it is. It's really that good. Well more accessible or make it a Long Island exclusive these were announced I think back in May we purchased them instantaneously and it took over a month we finally got our pickles I was happy the moment they were announced I was right online getting my MJF pickles you know what I really like about these pickles as well that they have these labels with the man himself MJF on it here we actually see him eating the pickle bloodied after a battle but they don't put any nutritional values on it so I don't know how much sodium I'm getting that affects my high blood pressure <laughs> I don't know it's I'm like just enjoying pickles and American pastime food with MJF an American hero so I'm wearing a patriotic shirt American <laughs> hero right here putting MJF's pickle in my mouth that, that, that came out a little Well, it's better than yours and you know it, so, I mean. All right. Time for some... Spears. MJF's Spicy Devils. Spicy Spears. I also like that all three pickles are different. So we have a spear, a whole pickle, and a chip. That's what I do enjoy also. I think I'm going to like some devil spears. My clown character is Satan. I like spicy food, so devilly spicy. That smells so good. Oh my god, so much juice! Never is a problem I've ever told. Yeah. Mmm, fine vintage. Mm I really cannot say out of the three of them, like, what is, like, a top one. I can say this about the three of them. None of them are bad. They are all delicious. Me here, this face here, eats a lot of pickles. I know I shouldn't. Sorry, Doc. So you might say I'm sort of a pickle snob. Yeah. All three of these pickles belong to live in my fridge and be in my belly. I mean, that's why growing up, like, getting, like, mm. 
Are you saying something, Joe? What, you stop saying it. You stop saying it. What, what's wrong? Growing up? That was horrible. I don't, I don't know what she's talking about. Growing up? I was having, um... You showed me peeled the pickles. What? <laughs> I just don't want to continue. Oh, you ruined your story. I'm afraid I'm going to get, uh... Blocked again. Well, these pickles are better than you. You know it. Well, yeah. Even the pickles that my grandma would usually have right. in the fridge. So, for our taste test and review, they're delicious. I mean, if you hate pickles, I wouldn't get them because you hate pickles. Well, yeah. But if you're a fan of pickles or mildly like pickles, these are some of the best pickles I've ever had. Yeah. Which I'm surprised. I'm like, we're from New York. The best pickles should come from New York, from, from, from California, but the delicious pickles. Well, it came from a strong island mind. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Long well, Island, the most magical spot in the world. <laughs> I guess uh, the man puts his label on some good pickles. He knows some good pickles. I say uh, they get our stamp of approval. Definitely. Mm-hmm. I think we could call it, Joy. These are the bee's knees. Yeah, they're, they're good pickles. If you have a chance to get <laughs> some MJF pickles, get them, enjoy them. And if uh, they're sold out, well, the company that made these, Kaylin and Kaylin's, well, they make good pickles, so just, go buy their other pickles because yeah. they make really delicious pickles. Or just write them saying that, you know, so many people want them to bring them back. Yeah, they're good. You can never have enough MJF in your life. I think we could call it though, Joy. I think so. MJF Pickles Taste Test and Review. Been, been there, done been. that. Remember, folks, safe travels. Good eats. And live life. Now, which one do I start and finish with? You can put all the pickles in your mouth, Joy. I think I'll go that order. Hmm. So, which one are you starting with? Which one are you finishing with? I think I'll start with that. You're ending with the. So, these are your favorite. Well, this was good and it's got a nice lingering kick to it and this would help settle that kick like it's got a nice kick yeah enjoy it as a nice food but these are good they were all very very good pickles mjf you did good kid you did good <laughs>